In the last 45 minutes, a tow truck lifted this car off of the train tracks. This is in North Charlotte after the driver crashed. So this is right by Urban Ministry just off of North Tryon. Reporter Anthony Castura is live there now. And Anthony, please say the driver hit two people before crashing. Yeah, it's just an incredible story for so early in the morning. Police say that he hit two women, drove at least a mile away, went down in an embankment, and then crashed into the railroad tracks behind me. I want to show you some of the damage where actually EMT and other investigators actually broke through the fence here uh, near that railroad station. The biggest question investigators are trying to figure out this morning is why someone would do this. We want to show you a look at the car as crews pulled it from the tracks, as you just mentioned. They say it was wedged between trees, making it even even more difficult to access and they say this will likely delay the railroad schedules today because even though the car is gone, they still need to inspect the tracks to make sure it is fully functional. Again, this all happened about two this morning. This is near College and 6th Street and then in, ended here at Liddell and Tryon. Uh, you can see investigators, medic, firefighters and EMT CSI crews were also out here as well, trying to get access to the vehicle so they could get to the driver. The amazing part of all this is that the two women walked away untouched. Of course, again, we are still waiting to learn the name of the man that was involved and of course what led up to the situation as well. We'll stay on top of this for you and bring you the very latest as we get it. We'll send it back to the studio for now. All right. Anthony, live there in North, North Charlotte. Thank you.